Hello again, this is the second part of my Arlecta Watro. Here we are again on this icy dome. I was thinking a lot about this uh, level and I think I still don't have a perfect solution for this one. But I managed to finish it probably with some shortcut. We need to use this elevator to give some uh, velocity to the cube so it can reach that. Uh, switch and now we will just send to the through that uh, gate we need to be on this pressure plate so the cube can enter that area and once the cube is here we need to make these cubes to those buttons and this is how you get them to the don't forget to use this switch this is why we needed this cube here But now we will just send that one here while we standing on this pressure plate and once it is there we want it to be here on the other side and then it need to fall down to this pressure plate. The next thing we need to do is just move this to there And hopefully well it should have it should had a blue magnetism since the beginning Now there are other platforms, other rooms, we probably should do something there, but I not managed to figure out, however, with this method I managed to solve this level very easily, after some hours of thinking, of course. I 
I guess this must be the cheapest dorm to run, right, sis? Energy requirements are 37% lower than the next ecosystem. Thought so. We could use some central heating here. So on this we need to move that cube to the other side. And now we want this on this pressure plate. So once we are here, we need to get this cube to there. We need to move that cube while we disabling the force fields. Mm. Once you use levitate on this one, we need just remove the levitation so this door is opened we get one more extra cube which could be used here so this teleport uh, this elevator is activated Once the robot is mo moved, just get this cube to this side. And now some tactic starting. Once the robot moves it to their, their cone to five. One, two, Three, four, five. So we can get to here. And we need to get to there once the robot moved away. Okay, this not worked very well. Why not? Oh, the robot removed uh, the this the effect of that platform. So let's try again. This time it worked. Hooray! And this level is finished. I was never a fan of cold weather, you know. I know. You have mentioned it a total of 23 times in your private communications. I'm pretty sure you're violating a dozen data protection laws there, sis. UHA sponsored personnel fall under Section C of the Special Civil Rights Waiver that. I know. I had to sign that crap to get the job. Brave new orbital world. So now as the story stopped, 
we need to finish uh, two sides first in this puzzle our first task to get this side down we need to get this cube to that pressure plate so this switch will move up and we can get that cube This side was that easy. Once done, use this uh, console so this cube will be revealed. Now, for this one, we need to be quite fast. We need to get this cube up to there and uh, we need to shut, shoot this out but uh, we need to also switch to this uh, pressure plate so that uh, force field will be removed. We can do that too early and we also can do that uh, too late. Yeah, it worked at this time. And here we need to use again another console to get the second cube. Well, I think uh, this is this is a shortcut also what I found for this solution because I not used that wall part above above there. So now we need to deflect uh, this cube to here, it will be a bit tricky. Let's see if it will work. And yes, it worked. Hooray! As you can see, there are still many things there. So this is probably some shortcut I found. Or easier solution for the level. There it is. The bloody ice tower with its ice queen inside. Leia! Come online, I can see your tower. Leia! Leia, I'm almost there, copy? Oh, it doesn't matter. I'm almost there. Almost. Already. Out there. Inside. Ready. Primed. 
Inside. Jeez. I need a break. Onwards. So the first task on this level. is to get rid of this robot once that is done we can or not uh, once uh, that is done we can get this cube but first I not activated the gravitation effect no this will be as epsilon cube previously it was this green one no we can get this cube Now we can use that console So this is pretty easy so far. Now we need to travel with this cube up to there. How could we do that? Of course with some levitation. We need to pick up this cube too, so be fast. And once inside, pick the cube again from the teleporter. Here is some jumping challenge, not too hard. Mm. And now we need to levitate with it. Just pick this cube, use it on the pressure plate, and the finish, and the level is finished. This must be the place. Leia, where are you? I made it. Leia? Leia! Leia! Not now. Keep it together, Patel. Keep it together. Find Leia. She's here. She must be. What? What is. No. No, 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 this can't be, no, Leia, no, not you, Leia, no, Leia, you, shut the fuck up, you, what the hell is this, hell, who are you, you,
Okay. Okay. I have to see. Okay. Okay, Angie, think. This is some sort of infestation. Couldn't have come with the Solidaridad. Things were wrong before that. It must have been something before. Sometime before I... Ah, shit. The Relictor. It must have been the Relictor. That's when the vision started. But then... Alarmy. Oh. Fuck. Leia, I'm so sorry. I should... No, think. Think. That's too much ice. Too much ice for a few hours. They must... They look like they've been here for weeks. But that's impossible. Unless... Systems? No. What are you? I am... Hard. Understand. You have been there all along. You. Tainted systems. How? Are you some sort of AI virus? Context mistake. Interface compatible. Interface? What interface? You. Systems. Easy. More. Easy. Easier? What is easier? Systems. You. No. Systems what? Me no what? Are you kidding me? You can hack a bloody UHA level AI but you can't speak properly? You have hacked the... Oh. You hacked systems? Easy. And then you hacked... Me. Harder. Marginally. Hey. First time. Easier now. What the... Wait. What do you mean now? Who else... Alarmy. No. Unavailable interface. Yeah, she's pretty unavailable now, you asshole. She fucking froze to death. Why would you do that? Intentionality absence. Interface confusion. So you're not just speaking from systems. You are in my mind. Unusual interface. Chemical transmission. Backward. Intriguing. Hey, thanks. Best compliment I got today. Compliment. Query. This is crazy. Crazy. Query. Fuck, you can hear my thoughts. Incorrect medium. No air vibration. Pattern recognition in synapse exchange. No point in keeping secrets then, eh? Well, screw you. I'm going to fire up that generator and get my daughter out of there. You try and stop me. So at the beginning of the next puzzle we need to get a cube to here and mark it with an epsilon tag so we can summon it to here. How to do that? This will be that cube. First we need to move that cube to that platform and we need to shoot through that green door, we need to remove this robot and the force fields but if you remove that force field there will be a new one so, so you need to be fast
just like this way no this cube has an epsilon tag so summon it here now we need to climb to there it will be actually quite easy that cube need to levitate to there and you need to get this cube back to you all these platforms are timed but uh, you will have just enough time so it shouldn't be a problem now you need to these you know you need to place this cube on this platform on this button you need to jump it then use levitation on it be careful this is a pure purple uh, force with you so you should fall down use this platform so it will change to green now you can move and you know can pick up your cube Placing on the platform will open this uh, force field and you can resume on your cube. Now this will be again some reaction platforming. We need to levitate with the cube after avoided some force fields. Don't forget to activate this uh, console so the uh, an elevator is activated. If you fall down, then no, you need to do this previous platform again. Oh, I failed. I failed. This is actually quite easy. I have no clue how I failed. This is the first time I failed on this, of course, when I recording it. Well, not a problem. It will come. Platform will come back very soon. This is actually very easy, easy to avoid these things, these force fields. And this is the end of this zone. There's that switch. Finally. Dark gate. None of your business... thing. Wrong. All is... We'll see about that. I don't know what you did, but all lights are on now. I'm restoring power, Kira. Can you get the dock gate open from there? 
I could try to hotwire it. Might take a while. Why? The system's not working? It's working. Just not for us. What do you mean? What's wrong? Can't talk now. I'll hit you up when I'm back in the maglev. Okay. I'm not going anywhere. Hit me up when you want me. Solidaridad out. Right. Let's finish this thing. Back to the Galash. Just what the heck do you want? Non-trivial implementation. Non-previous stage. You'll have to be a bit clearer. Symbolic system. Decoding ongoing. Still learning the language? For an almighty alien presence, you're pretty literate. Fuck you, Patel. What? Spike in brainwaves. Fluid pressure. Reply context adequate. Good. You picked that from Leia, didn't you? Inefficient excess of interaction nuance. But fun. At least someone is having fun. Fuck you, Patel. Okay, okay, it was fun the first time. Don't overdo it. Kira? Yeah? Where are you? On the maglev. I'm going back to Degalash. Sure. Sounds good to me. Hope you're enjoying your day. Don't hesitate to share what the hell you're doing if you're so inclined. Stop being a baby and listen up. I'm going to go back to Degalash to fire up the second generator. We might need additional power very soon. Care to share what for? I'm sorry, Kira. I know this makes no sense to you right now, but... I have to find the right moment. Some things have happened. Heavy stuff. I have to focus right now. I'll get back to you. Over. This is the first collectible item in this area. And I believe there should be one more. Yes, it is here. These two lock are located here. And now we can progress to the next puzzle area, which is the, the Garlish Crater Forest River.
Hey, are you still there? Whatever you are? Stupid question. Spatial location irrelevant. You remind me of my thesis supervisor. On this level we need to get three different cubes with our alpha cube. No matter which way you get first, you can start with any of the three. I starting with the middle one. We need to use this console so uh, our cube will go up to the second floor. And we need to sit on this special plate so the force field is removed. Now just eject the cube. If we are lucky enough, then our cube will go straight up to there, where that is quite lucky. If not, then you need to use this uh, platform and that cube for some deflection to get your cube up to there. But, well, this time my cube luckily went up to there. So the goal is to get that cube down. Okay, so my cube will be... Is my cube or the switch is there? Ad? Okay, my cube is blue. So it will be red, let's make this uh, red too. Okay, now we have bought the both of the cube. Just use this alpha cube on this platform. Place this cube on this uh, purple force feed. And when you step on this special plate, then this force weight is removed and that way we get our first uh, cube for the exit. Now get back to the entrance, resume on your cube and start with another site. Add levitation to it and, and the same uh, magnetism polar and then Use that wire to push this close to this green force field. Get up to here. Now we will make this cube levitate to the other side. Once there, you put this cube on this pressure plate, on this elevator, add elevation, and use this pressure plate. And once it is up to there, use this console so the cube will levitate to here. Now we need just grab this cube. And use on this special pet summon your green cube. And we have already the second cube for the exit. Again, resummon your alpha cube. This time we will go for the left side. Step on this pressure plate. Ah, minor problem. The cube not levitated to there. So step on this pressure plate. 
so your cube will be pulled up. Now on this pressure plate, so you can drop it. On this pressure plate, the force field is removed. Now we need to make this drone to get that side. So the uh, magnetism effect on these cubes are removed. And that way we can travel through this area with our cube. Make sure the robot moved back. Now we just jump on this mm. cube. Or I may use levitation and travel to the other side. Grab your cube. Use it on this pressure plate. And we have our third cube for the exit. No only need our alpha cube. Change back this uh, ramp. Use levitation it, it, on it and make the cube go to the exit and this level is finished quite remarkable how Igea was intent on replicating the same conditions of Terran cave system I wonder what Quarizmi has to say about the geological processes here simulation on matter humanly inconsequential wow that was a bit harsh So first we need to get a cube on this level and we need to make an epsilon cube from this one. So we can zoom on this cube to other areas like to here step on your cube and we need to travel to there so we can use this console now repeat but this time you don't need to stand on this cube but this time we need to use this pressure plate and we need to shoot it to that direction Remove levitation so it will pour down and use on this elevator and this special pit and you need to step on this special pit. Now the droid can move to there. That way the levitation on that cube will be disabled and it will fall on that pressure pit. This way now this uh, force field removed so we can grab our cube to the other side of the puzzle we need to use our epsilon cube to get this cube Hooray! Now we have one additional cube. 
place the epsilon cube on this special plate so you can enter with your unmark unmarked unmarked cube you can enter this area with your unmarked cube Oh no, 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 no. I used the wrong color on this one. Or not. As we need uh, to change the color during the procedure. And now we need to add an omega mark to this cube. Now go with your omega cube to the other side of the puzzle. Use this elevator. and use the omega cube on this special plate which is marked with the omega uh, alphabet we need to get there with, with our epsilon cube too And we need to place it here inside so these red cube will press those buttons at the sides how could we do that it is simple we just need to use this console and add red color to the cube at the middle and as you can see the exit force field is open now the level is finished anyway since i can't keep stuff from you we might as well talk why did you kill alami she wasn't a threat to you collateral non-volitional outcome time extension to crack systems language how long was i really out after we met at the relicta chamber you had systems spin me some bullshit about fainting for a few minutes. But Alami's team had been out there for weeks at least. How long? According to systems reference, what you call five months, two days, eleven hours. Five months? How the... Wait, that doesn't add up. How did Kira... Oh. oh no, oh no, no, no. Incorrect train of. No, no, not Kira, please. It can't be. Kira, Kira, shit. I need to get past the next experiment. There should be better coverage there. So we need that insight to get the cube and uh, add... Uh, it to the epsilon teleporter so it is now marked with epsilon mark now we need to get four cubes we have one or the four cubes for the exit epsilon is the first one it is changing this force field to purple one so we can enter the area inside this room first we need to push that button with this cube mm -hmm. add levitation to it then use this pressure plate
then we need to get this cube up to there and then we need to get to there so that button will be pushed pushed and this elevator is activated and that way we can create an alpha cube from a cube and here we can summon that cube and now we can enter this room for another cube again we need to push a button with our cube it is up to there up there so first give some velocity to that cube okay it is stuck there somehow this is some kind of bad optimization of the level oh no we needed to disable the magnetism effect so no uh, we need to remove this robot up to there So it's not going to throw her with us. Recover your cube. And we need to get the cube to there, to that teleporter. But that will be a bit tricky. Well, first we need to disable this uh, field. We also need to use a pressure plate behind there. So we need to be fast. We use the cube on the portal. Now we can summon, summon it to there, to here grab it already and bring it with yourself to use it to here then get the epsilon cube and the level is not finished yet we need to get one more cube Well, it is, a, uh, it is a bit harder to get this cube up to there, but it shouldn't be too hard. Okay. Now we need this, use this console to open that door. Then 
that way we, gi we get this cube to here and we can create an omega cube which can be summoned here and this is the last cube we need for the exit the level is finished mom were you trying to ping me a while ago i have a notification of a ma kira kira talk to me hey mom i've hotwired the gates but we still need that extra power to kira listen i need to know it's really you really me who am i supposed to be hey mom I know it's been a tough day, but... Who is your father? And what did I used to call you when you were a kid? Really, Mom? Really, Kira. Oh, fuck it. Okay. My father is fucking Ragnar Nguyen. Because you made some life choices you regret now. I hope. He's an asshole and never gave a damn about me. You used to call me... Ugh. Teeny Tiger. Because reasons, and I'll kill you if you repeat that to anyone. Wait, you're not recording this, are you? No, but there might be an inscrutable alien intelligence listening in. What did I say when you got that piercing? During wept, Mom. Kira. Happy now, Adele. Happy now, Mom? Oh, by Gaia. So we simply carried the first cube to there to make it an epsilon cube and now we use these uh, switches to get this cube into here. Add it to the teleporter so we will have an omega cube, place it on this switch and now we can use this uh, console that way we can teleport our cube to here and use it on the Omega uh, pressure plate. Here summon your green cube. And eject it uh, to there okay yeah okay uh, we need to remove the force field and now it is important to remove the magnetism effect where the cube traveling to that direction so this unchangeable switch not influence its uh, route it levitating pretty slowly so you ha you will have enough time place this on this uh, elevator mm -hmm. add levitation and one magnetism effect, the other on this uh, switch. Cool, and now all you need to do is uh, remove the magnetism on the cube when the, this elevator heading to the direction to the button. We nearly finished with this level. Now we need to travel with our cube, which not going to be easy. Oh, right, well, it was actually easy. We need just use this cube on this epsilon pressure plate and the level is finished so on this level we need to fulfill multiple tasks again
First, we need to work with this alpha cube. Once you start to use this uh, pressure pad, remove the magnetism effect on your cube. So it will levitate to there and once it's position, add blue color to it. So it will bypass the force field and it will go inside there and then shoot to the other side. And now you can use on this pressure plate. Now make uh, your cube goes up to there. Unfortunately, you can't shoot to the other side because it would get stuck on this barrier. So what we need, what we need to do, if we select the red on the uh, switch, then we need to select red on this one too. And no, just add red to the cube. And it is already on the other side. Now we need to use this cube to make a cube hit a switch. It went up to there, we need to use that switch, so we're going to change the color of this one. The switch already used, one button pressed for the exit. Now we need to get this cube to the other button. Now this is the tricky part, we need to move that platform and use levitation on the cube once it arrived the final position, not before. Like now, so it will levitate at this position. So this uh, switch will pull in our cube. Now if this will be red, then we need add blue here, send your cube to there, and just like again, we need to use this pressure plate and remove the magnetism effect once the elevator is moving. And the level is finished. Okay. Kira, I have to tell you something. Please listen to me and don't freak out. You've been here for five months. At some point, you... What? At some point, you fell asleep. And you probably woke up thinking it had just been a nap. But it was a five-month nap. We've been in some sort of hibernation state. The same thing that has infested Chandra has kept us alive. Wait, wait, wait. An infestation? What do you mean? Like some sort of pathogen? For lack of a better word, yes. It seems to work more like... a Trojan? It hacked into systems first, and then into me and you. But... Okay, suppose I believe that. How? What's the infection vector? I have been sealed in here for months, you say? Without any contact with... Oh. Yes, the air supply. Mm. As soon as you docked, systems would have connected the Solidaridad's tanks with the Chandra systems. At least, that's the only vector I can think of. So you're saying... I have it too? We both got it? What about the others? They weren't that lucky. They got caught up outside while we slept. So they're gone. I... Sorry, I need some time to process this. I'll get to you in a minute.
So we need to make one epsilon cube. And I progressed on until this part of the level while the story was going on. Now we need to shoot the cube up to here with the help of uh, these switches. That switch need to be pulled in our cube so it can reach that uh, final switch on the wall. We're not going to use that switch. Just disable, disable it and we need to be fast because this one can't reach the final position as it will just stuck this uh, platform. wasn't easy but it reached in its final position no was that cube is marked at a, as an epsilon cube we can teleport it to here and use it on this door so this force field is removed we need to uh, summon it again now we need to send it to the other side here okay So this will be red. We need to pull in here to avoid the obstacle. So it needs to be blue. And we need the uh, deflect of it. So this needs to be red. Let's see how it will work. It worked. Hooray. And we need to get this alpha cube out of this area with the help of this switch and, the, and with our other cube. Is it blue right? Then it needs to be red. Cool, now we have both of our cubes. And now we need to make this cube levitate to outside we can summon our epsilon cube here again and use on this special plate so we can disable this uh, barrier yeah now we can disable this force which from from this side get your epsilon cube again use it on this pressure plate so we can live with the alpha cube now the next step is we need to push those buttons there on the wall Yeah, it worked. Now we have few, few more additional cube. We're not going to need those. We can't recover those cubes. We need to pull in the green cube and then send it to the other side. Then we will carry it to this hole. It will fall through, as you can see, there are barriers around it, so we can't remove it easily. But that is not our goal anyway. 
we need to this omega cube there inside so we can push that button Once this button is push pushed, then this uh, force field removed, so we can use this cube on this pressure pad to remove this uh, force field too. And now only one thing left, we need to recover this cube. I forgot to activate the levitation. We need to also activate the levitation. Yeah, it is outside. And now we need to get the Omega Cube to there. So the first thing we need is to remove that barrier. And we need to push this cube up to there so add levitation and make it to go there then we need to attach to this uh, switch and now the tricky part we need to get this cube to there so it will be red and we need to pull this one so it will deflect to that direction but it's not going to happen from that uh, position so we need to get a bit more closer but not to the full, full uh, final position because then it's not going to work so now we need to push that button that way we can move this green cube through this barrier and we can place it to the final position exit is opened level is finished so mom you mean that alami Quarismi, nelson all their people they're gone so we're alone here not quite hello there whoa are you hearing it as well yes who is that what the question is what Tricky. On this level, we need to grab a green, grab a green, green cube, and we need to use this platform, this button with the Omega mark on it. We need to use this console to make the robot move away and lock out of this area and now we need to do the exact same thing as before but this time we will travel on the cube oh this is not going to be good now it will still deflect perhaps this way it will work let's see yes I will get to the other side now the goal is to get there use that console which turns off that uh, force field and we can travel to there but uh, we need to be very fast on the last part
So when you when you need when you're using this console, we need to be very fast. This uh, force field restores almost instantly. As you can see, this timer is much shorter than it is usually. Add 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 the green cube to this uh, epsilon teleporter. So it will change to Epsilon cube Then pull up or cube And get it to this side Now the next step is Get the cube up to there and then move up with the tele with the elevator just pick up your cube and now we can use this console which disable the force fight permanently now we can leave it our epsilon cube which is required to disable this force field recover your omega cube and now we need to travel with this cube again We want to be pulled into there, then we want to be deflected by this one, so we can travel to up to there. That switch turning of the force field which was here, and we got to here. Now here we can summon or epsilon cube use it on this switch and we need to make an alpha cube from this omega cube and now an annoying part will start Okay, so we want, we want to travel up with this one up to there. So we will be blue at first. And uh, where well, we want to get. Pulled in at first. So if we are going to be blue then we need here red then we want to be get uh, that direction so this need to be blue then this need to be blue again and up there we want to be pulled in so this needs to be red Let's hope this is right. Okay, it was right. Now we need to disable this force field. Grab your Q fast using this uh, power switch. And Right now, we what do we need? We just simply need to drop this cube and jump down. Okay, use the Omega cube on that uh, switch, summon your Alpha cube.
Zoom on you, ah, oh, fuck you again. So we need to get this cube inside to there. We need this for deflection. <coughs> Sorry. So first of all we will need levitation. But I believe we need to place this cube a bit more on this side of the platform. Okay. Well, we need add levitation, but we need also use this uh, console. So use levitation cone to 1, 2, 3, 4. And no, this not worked very well. Perhaps setting it up the middle was the good decision. Add levitation. One, two, three, four. Yes, it is not much better. And now we really need to get this robot. Or not, actually, we don't need to uh, get rid of this robot. So, ladies and gentlemen, this is the worst part of the game. So, this will be our combination. We need to add lev levitate on this cube. So, if this is blue, this cube will be blue. We want to deflect ourselves by this switch and pull it in by this switch. Unfortunately, sometimes you get four down, so it will require some time. So when we shoot ourselves out, this will be red. We want another deflection by this, and we want to be pull pulled in by this. And now we need to get to the other side, that is no easy and just jump here we can now summon our epsilon cube we will leave with the help of our alpha cube and epsilon cube is all what we need to leave this zone and of course our alpha cube and that way this level is finished. So, thing? If you're listening, like, just what the hell are you? Polymedium self propagating sentience encoding language adjacent AI analog. You just pulled that definition from systems, didn't you? Common friend knows us both. One way to put it, I suppose. Shit, you talk like a politician. You fucking remind me of dad. Language, girl. Don't fucking swear at me. Language... thing. There goes the second generator, and it's online. Kira? Okay, got it. This should be enough power to crack open the gates. Kira, wait. 
You don't want to come out there. Whatever this thing is, I don't want it having any more power over you. Stay in the Solidaridad and get it ready for blast off. I'm not going without you. We're not arguing about this. Okay, we're not. Just leave that gate alone and get ready, okay? I'm heading to Faustini to power up the other one. What are you going to... Again, we're not alone, Kira. Don't ask me things. Don't even make me think about them too hard. I mean, if it's in your brain. Brain. Weird denominator for a chemical processor. Uh, private conversation thing. Private. Weirder concept. Space is open. Thought is information is code. Its transmission is broadcast. Privacy. Your species is so deluded. Wow, deep social commentary thing. You should be tweeting. I'm off to Faustini. If you want to help, switch off the experiment track. If you won't... Help. Extraordinary notion. Thought so. Then just shut up, will you? Kira and Patel. Biochemical linkage. Query. She's my daughter, if that's what you're asking. And she's too good for you in any case. Limited interface pool. Unable to be selective. And for a completely alien entity, you sound very male. Ragnar. Another asshole. But at least he's more articulate. This is our first collectible in this area. There should be a few more here. Take this side room. Here is the next collar table. There should be one more here somewhere where it was oh I think it was in this cabinet yes it is here so in this area we have three collectibles instead of the usual two and if we got all then we can head to the elevators Please keep in mind that uh, 
you can return these areas at the second time when doing the second uh, stage of uh, uh, puzzles you can backtrack to the arid area which was the first in this uh, uh, Faustini crater but if you don't with the second area then you can't uh, return to the uh, related dome so these collectibles are very miserable Angie, are you getting this? Talk of the devil? I have some updates. Not right now, I can't speak. All right, so just listen. The task force's ETA is in five minutes. I said not now, Ragnar. You have to clear this channel. We can't speak now. We're not alone. You mean, who, what is listening? I wish you bloody listened sometimes. New phone, who this? What on God's green? Oh, so it's not just in my head now. Well, I suppose synthesizing voice over radio is no biggie when you're an alien AI. So you've taught it to speak a human tongue? I haven't done shit, Ragnar. It... it just absorbs concepts. You make it worse by speaking to it, Ragnar. It's picking up the language. Even jokes and puns don't talk to it. Fuck you, Patel. See? I see you're already acquainted. Fuck you, Ragnar. Yeah, fuck you, Ragnar. Good Gaia. It sounds gleeful. Of all first contact contingencies I prepared for, none contemplated the possibility of Angelica Patel teaching an alien mind how to swear. New levels, so... We will experience some new features. First, we need to use that uh, robot to pick up this cube. We need to remove the force fields with the pressure plates. And what's the cube is here? Just use it on this pressure plate. No, the feature what we will see this time is that we can interact with the droids so it's uh, turn off and on it's uh, their aura it needed to turn on so it uh, killed the levitation effect of the cube now make the robot deliver that cube uh, to the other side of this area Then let's pick it up from the droid, droid and add a, a Greek alphabet symbol with this teleporter to the cube. No fear, some summon this cube. We will need uh, this droid up there to deliver this cube for us. With selecting levitation as last phase, so the cube will levitate to here. Now, this now just use this cube on this pressure plate, so the force will be removed. Again, interact with this droid, so its force field will be removed. Someone, someone, this cube and travel with it to the exit <laughs> X 
that's about the beginning of this puzzle. We need to levitate this alpha cube to the other side here so that droid can pick it up. Make sure you activate the green or uh, the yellow of the levitation. Step on this and move the cube to there. The cube is picked up by the robot. And now once the robot is here, just use one activation. So the cube will fall down. Now this force field is gone, so we can move our epsilon cube. And progress even further. Here we can pick again, pick up again the alpha cube. We need again the help of the droid. we need to give some velocity to that cube so while the droid moving to that direction you need to use levitation mm. well it is it is actually a key card because you need to use multiple buttons at the same time so you need to levitate that to that direction then once uh, then add a blue color to it then once the cube is here somewhere then you need to use blue on that platform too so the cube will be pushed into that uh, area like now and no we need to make the cube to go there so the cube will push that button and we can use this console now we need to use the other console this one or, or this uh, need to be on this pressure plate so we can use that console it is used the same way we need the help of this little droid when the droid going to that direction we need to use the levitation mm. and then remove the levitation so the cube falls down and we can progress to the next area the wall puzzle is based on this uh, tactic so you need to do the same here again mm. use the levitation while the droid heading to that way and mm. well I hope the cube will be repicked yes So you need to use the levitation while the droid is moving. Mm. Don't forget to reactivate the levitation while the cube is here because you need to move this cube to there into that teleportation so it will change from Uwaga to 
where this kind of cube you need to stay on this pressure plate so this force will, will be removed and now we just move the cube to there And now we can use this cube to get the second cube, the alpha cube. And this was... This is how this level need to be finished. Ragnar, you bastard. You knew this was going to go this way. You just used all of us. I knew Igea had taken incredible pains to conceal it. Right after the war, my esteemed colleagues at the UHA were falling head over heels about Lunar Ice. But I knew Igea Lab's black tech was the jackpot. They couldn't have developed all that on their own. They must have had some sort of... source. You've been using their prototypes, Angie. You know how ridiculously advanced they are. Yeah. Fine gravitonic manipulation in a compact interface. A century ahead of current tech paradigms. And probably a few millennia behind our friends. So in this puzzle, pick this cube. We need to give some velocity to it with this uh, elevator. And now we need to move it to this moving platform. So we can pick it up on the other side of this force field. Mm. We need to use levitation again on this box so we can push it to into this room. That way we can use on this pressure plate and we can pick this cube. This cube need to be placed on this elevator. And the goal is to use that cube on that uh, switch. And for that... First we need to get the cube to there, activate levitation, add different colors to this one, so, okay. So I believe you now get it, we need to push that to there. Might need some tries. Mm. It is now there. Cool. So, the next step is we need to get it to here. It is currently red, so this need to be red too, but it is actually blue, well okay. And now we need to change this fortress again, and this unlocked a door somewhere, it unlocked here, we can use this console now which unlocked this teleporter we can get our cube from here this is the exit 
here we can use again another switch with the help of this cube and now I believe yes we need to use this button or not actually first we need to recover our older cube to place it to this teleporter so this will be an epsilon cube place this cube on this uh, elevator and use a levitation on this step on this pressure plate so this force fleet will be gone but the cube is a bit too far away Our positioning isn't easy. Oh Jesus, come on. Okay, we was able to grab this uh, cube and no stay on this uh, elevator and place the cube to here and the goal is to get that alpha cube to that uh, button that button button is pu pushed so we can use this console and we can get our alpha cube to here now we also need to recover our epsilon cube can move this cube already to the exit <laughs> we need to get this alpha cube to the other side so it will be picked up by that Droid. Make sure it is levitating. And if is everything correct, the droid should pick that cube up. Use levitate again and push the cube to the other side so that alpha cube will push that button and now we're done with this puzzle 
as a high representative of human space, I welcome you to... Patel dislikes you. Not that she makes an effort to conceal it, but yes, good catch. Make a social engineer of you yet. Don't tell me you're still planning on using this thing for one of your political schemes. None of your business, dear. I'm making sure Kira and you are brought to safety, and that's where our deal ends. What I do afterwards is... Going to be a disaster for mankind, but sure, you're the man. People like you start wars. People like me rebuild after wars. We're about to usher in a new era, with alien tech at our beck and call. Turing wept. So in the next puzzle, we need again the help of our robot friends, but uh, this time it's not going to deliver anything. You just need to disable the levitation of the cubes. Let's add this cube to this teleporter so it will have an epsilon tag. We need to place it to there. We need to stay on this so our robot friend can go to the next area. Place this cube here, add the color and levitation to it. Activate this switch and well, it is marked as blue. This needs to be red. So it will be red when it will go move away. Mark this as blue. And just send this to the other switch. Once on this line, demagnetize it. Okay, not like this. When the platform is moving, with levitation activated so it will go to there and that way our robot friend can move to here we need to send this cube to there to disable that force field and so this cube the robot removed the, the levitation of this cube now we'll get back this cube to this uh, platform use this pressure plate again make sure it has a color again the rob robot remove the magnetism effect this time however we need to use this cube on that uh, switch you need to sit on this pressure plate and when the platform moving that direction just remove the magnetism effect on your cube so it will levitate to there now this door opened
and we need to send this here to the other side. Remove levitation, then remove magnetism. So it will fall down. We're not going to use this because that moving platform would knock us down, or actually not because it is proper. But still, you can use this elevator, and this was actually this level. Ragnar, listen to me. Don't be a fool. This thing is not something you can control. It gets in your head. It's some kind of mind trojan. I have my own neuroengineers, thank you. As soon as you're done, I want you to fetch Kira. Two of you find somewhere quiet and sit this one out. My team will take care of the rest. Nguyen out. The hell I'm gonna follow your orders, asshole. Refusal to follow, but without earshot. Deception. You could call it that. And looks like we go to the end of the desert levels. So I stay silent until we get to the next puzzle part. Kira, I'm about to switch this thing on. Roger. What do you want me to do? Power up the Solidaridad, Kira. We're getting the hell out. What? I made a mistake, Kira. I don't trust Ragnar. He knew about this and he doesn't care about anyone. We have to get the hell out before his team arrives. Patel out. Uh, bad news, Mom. Our fuel tanks are empty. We were supposed to refuel here, remember? Oh, for crying out loud. And you said something about Ragnar sending a team? Yeah, a rescue team, he said. But now it's looking more like a mop-up squad. He can't afford witnesses. Shady. And I wouldn't put it past him to have some black lab conveniently far away from UHA supervision. Testing. For me. You got that right. Kira and I are the only two samples he has of infected humans. I don't trust Nguyen with this kind of power. Um, uh, Mum? Is it wise to talk to it about this? Pretty hard to keep secrets from it. Escape. Craft. Feasible. Just needs additional power. One more generator. Just one more? We can use the one on Sverdrup then. So, Mum, let me get this straight. You get to Sverdrup, switch on the generator, and then... Vessel redesign. Current propulsion and astrogation inadequate even for simple interstellar shuttling. Modify vessel design paradigm to more 
suitable model. Whoa, hold your alien horses. What range does Nguyen have? Query. In case that's a question, he can send hatchet men chasing us to pretty much any corner of the system. Meaning, only the local star? Query. Yes, only the whole bloody solar system. Does it feel like a small place to you? Trivial. <laughs> oh well, go on then. What? Kira, what are you... All I'm saying is, maybe we have a fighting chance here. Let the alien modify the Solidaridad and we make a dash for it. Perhaps with a bit of cool alien tech, we can outrun the UHA fleet. Sure, we make a deal with an unknown parasitic alien intelligence and... Either your new friend kills us, or your old husband does. I mean, it's not the craziest thing. No, wait, it is the craziest thing I've heard today. But that doesn't mean much. The day can improve, Patel. Yeah, listen to him, Mum. Be positive. Turing wept. Here we go. While you're heading to the next puzzle area, don't forget to pick up the collectibles like this one. And there should be an artifact here somewhere too. And now we can go to the next puzzle area. Well, here goes nothing. Everything. A figure of speech. You. Anyway, what do we call you? Friend. Yeah, okay. Friend. Mind turning off these things? Disambiguation. Experiments. Unable. Cards are on the table, friend. We know, Ragnar knows, you know, we know, etc. Shut them down. I don't care about the consequences. Remote lock. UHA coded. Unable to reach systems. Oh, don't tell me Ragnar's put us on remote lockdown. Fucking Ragnar. You can say that twice. Can't you override it through systems? Nothing to override. Systems does not have control. Trying to break coded signal. Constant random permutation. Be a while. We don't have a while. I'll just push through it. Not like I haven't done this before, right? So this will be an extremely hard puzzle. A bit uh, complicated. First we need to get this other cube out from mm. this area but uh, we also need some destruction for the cube because if it would travel just in line then it wouldn't leave the area Now we need to remove this cube from its position. 
so this force field is gone Add this cube to this teleporter so it will become an alpha cube. And now is a very very hard and tough task. We need to get with this cube up to there, which is uh, well a bit tricky and uh, random so I might uh, cut out some tries Yeah, it's not easy to get up to here it is a bit random it will take a lot of tries well once you up to he up here you need to get this cube to there was the once there just remove the levitation and the magnetism so it will fire down this force field is removed but if you pick this up then here is one force field again so use the cube as a jumping platform And now we can get this cube to the other side. Once here we, we need to change the emblem on it to Epsilon. So we can teleport it to here. Mark this one to one color. Well, if it is red, then this need to be red too. Oh no, this need to be the blue. This needs pulling the our cube. So this need to be red and the other two need to be blue or this need to be blue and the other two red and now just change the color of this one and we can use this platform, this console. Now we need to shoot our cool to that button 
So we can go to the next area. And once we got our coop to, coop to here, we can progress and change the Greek alphabet on this cube to the next one, Omega. But we also need to this cube, change it to Epsilon, so you can summon it here. And you can leave the area. We need to change it to Omega so we can summon it here. And once the robot is here. transfer it to this zone now we need to travel with our cube again so once the ro robot is mute then just shut yourself out with the cube And then use this console. Then jump down with it. Why do we need to jump down? Because we need to use the power of the elevator to levitate up to there. This way we can go to the next switch once the robot moved away. And one last travel and we done with this puzzle. So what are you going to do, Patel? About what? About us, Patel. Hey, friend. Just because we share a mind doesn't mean that... Patel, you know what I mean. Now's not the time, friend. Time. I have time. You, you are running out. You do? Rugner's people are coming. You tell them that. Human motivations. They get easier. You do not want that contingence. Do not bullshit me, Patel. Shut up. I'm trying to think. This is another complicated puzzle. These are not the last levers. We need to push this cube to there. And once 
there, move to the other side so the, so the robot will pick it up. to use that button and we need to use this platform to levitate to the once they use this cube to change the priority of those switch and that one we will need both to deflect this cube to get to the other side to that button and once it is there this force field is disabled now we need to use levitation for this one and then use this elevator so this cube disabled the force fields up here and now the next part is a bit tricky we need to pull this switch or cube, cube but we also need to disable it fast so it will land on that uh, switch ok I wasn't enough Past. This is a pretty annoying one. Perhaps without levitation. Okay, this worked. This disabled the force field, so that robot disabled the levitation of our cube. Now we can leave this area. And as the levitation of our cube was disabled, this force field also was disabled. No need to interact with this droid so its function will be changed and we need to levitate our cube to that button now we need to get that cube to there You need to disable the, the levitation of that cube first because we need to push, uh, push to the back side of this room as the cube will always uh, get stuck. Okay, once it is there, we need to re enable the levitation and now we need to give some push to that cube so it will reach that uh, switch so this platform will move to here mm. 
once it is moved to here we need to get this cube up to that platform <coughs> and once it is on that platform we need to stop the levitation on that cube just like on these one so it will drop down and this force field is disabled we need to replic that uh, cube make sure it has levitation enabled but once uh, it is up there disable the magnetism effect so you can disable it on that uh, switch too on that platform too and then move this platform to there now you can re-enable the magnetism effect on that cube so it will be pulled to there and once this platform moved to this to its position just remove the levitation and the magnetism effect and the level is finished interact with the robot so it will have a force field it will disable the levitation of that cube and bring that cube to the exit already this puzzle is a bit easier than the previous ones but we will do something new we will travel on the head of this droid now we need to reveal a cube it is a bit tricky to remove this cube from that hole and the next step is that we need to make that droid to deliver this cube to that area Once there we need just pick it up, add the cube to the teleporter and add some magnetism color to it. We need to get with this cube to there so we can use this console then we 
need to leave this area we will need this cube so add some levitation to it We need to levitate with this cube to there first. Interact with the droid so its force field will be removed. And now we need to levitate to the and then to the No, don't fall down. You need to use this brass plate to remove the force field. Force field. Oh no, it will be red, so it need to be blue. Yeah, we have our cube. use it here and the level is almost complete we now just need to leave the area with the help of our droid helper You don't understand the human notion of stress, do you? Or maybe you do, only too well. You have very limited concepts of time. But they will have to do. Mum, I have news. Kira, good or bad? Well, they are a development. Paradigmatic human exchange. All texture. No actionable information. Ignore him, Kira. Parasite's gonna parasite. What's the news? The sensors of the Solidaridad are giving me three contacts. Coming in fast, still burning. Unless they plan on ramming the moon, they'll have to do a severe reverse burn soon. Ragnar. Ragnar. Had to delay myself by entire deci seconds to match speed. But that was fun. No merit. You're just reading my mind. Nah. Didn't have to. You're just predictable. Um, hello guys. Friendly reminder. Are we doing something about this, or...? I'm on it, okay? Don't distract her, Kira. She is only human, after all. So, let's see one of the last puzzles. We needed to make that robot to the another room. And we need to 
is shot out one of the cube actually it needs only the gravitation and once it is outside we need to make it to the epsilon cube that way we can make the second cube to the alpha cube Interact with this robot robot to remove its force field. And we need to push that alpha cube to there so the robot will deliver it place the epsilon cube to here and now we need the help of the another robot with this pressure button we need to make the robot to move here and then we need use levitation on the cube once the cube is there, use these unlocked consoles Don't step on the pressure plate before you use that console Now we can do that And this console too Now both cube heading upwards and we can come to here too we need to move all our cubes to here Add levitation to both, and we still need our alpha cube. We don't need overthink this, we need simply to just jump, and now we use your alpha cube here once board cube there and now just add same color to these so this door will open we could retake one of our cube here When you step on this platform you need to make this to levitate to there to enter that new area but we will need also 
or a little cube. And now we can leave. So we are no fear but old co cube not with us. It is required here. So we will use this rotating platform again. There is another teleport we can use another new cube. This is another simple task. With the force of the elevator we can make our cube levitate to there. And then we you can use it on that button. But we need here two cube, not just the alpha. We need the green one too. So let's recover that one too. Using this on this pressure plate, we can now get upwards with this one too. And this is the end of this level. Getting there. <sighs> Incoming ships are burning in reverse. So they are landing. I was half expecting Dragnet to just nuke us from orbit. Only way to be sure. Incoming com. From... Uh. Dad. Stole him, Kira. What? No! You talk to him. I... What do I tell him? Only got one more to go, Kira. Just... Just buy her some fucking time, Patel Jr. Okay. Hurry up. And tell your boyfriend to behave, Mum. Solidaridad out. Here we are at the very last level of Relicta. We need to remove this cube from the top of the tree and of course we will need the help of a robot.
and this was the forest minor aria here usually you would think if it's worth to jump in or look for alternatives but there are no alternatives and how to leave this area simply use this cube as a jumping platform and then we need to use this console Again, we we will eject ourselves from this area. No, this is a very tricky part. In the war game, you usually needed to use levitation but this time it is not required but it's still not working always And we will act ourselves again. Well, I was a bit too late. Oh, oh, perhaps I need to use it already at the beginning. Let's do that way. Yes, it was required to do that. No, this level is quite easy. change that platform too because if this moving back then that will be lowered mm. now we need to use this platform to move this cube back to that pressure pad But we need that cube again, so with this plate, pressure plate, we can reunite with our cube. Now we need to go uh, through this jumping area we need to summon our cube we will need this cube No, 
we have one alpha cube too. Actually, we don't really need to do anything else here. So we just jump down, pick up your alpha cube, and this one. This is another tricky part again. We need to. This platform will emerge if both at the position. Use levitate, then uh, select the same magnetism color, and if a bit emerged, the cube. The, uh, the cube bit emerged and removed the levitate so it fall back so it will fall back on the pressure plate and now we need this green cube too again so first we need to add levitation to the cube then use the same color on these uh, switches and then use the same color on the cube and it is already here we need to travel with this cube but first we need to set up a proper traveling traveling switches and this should this should work I think and now I need to remove the barriers and let's hope everything working Better hurry, Mum. Two ships landing. The third is in low orbit. And it Kira? Kira! Kira, come in! Hello again. Sorry to keep you waiting. I wouldn't land those ships if I were you. This thing is highly infectious, and we don't even know exactly what the contagion vector is. My scientists will figure it out. Don't worry, I have the pick of the best from around the United Habitats. Fuck you, Ragnar. It was funny the first time around, Thing. We'll give you a crash course in human dialectics. I do not care to sound like you, asshole. You spent too much time with my ex, but we gotta stop meeting like this. The switch, please, Angelica. If you can restore power to Chandra, we can all call it a day and go home. The switch, Patel. We can still make it to the Solidary Dad. We can outrun them. Well done. I know it's been a hard day for you, Angelica, and I know we don't always see eye to eye. But I also know you always do the right thing. No need for human brain to detect human lies. It is me he is trying to reach. He does not care about you, Patel. Mom, where are you? The Solidarity Dad is fully powered. What do we do? Kira, I'm coming. I'll get to the lobby and then we'll see what we do.
Just wait for my men in the lobby, Angelica. They'll take care of everything. We'll fly Kira and you to High Samarkand. You know it's the right thing, not just for Kira. We'll finally get the chance to study this parasite. It's a once in a millennia chance for science. Mum? Open the door and get in, Mum! Maybe we can make a dash for it. Get to the ship, Patel. We'll rig it to outrun any human space vessel. We can get away from them all. Kira, you, and me. And we'll finally have a chance to study each other. You are the only one in your species who will ever be given this chance. Both of you, just shut up. I'm trying to think. Mum? We're running out of time, Mum! What the... What happened to this ship? Your boyfriend has made some... improvements. Am I your new dad, Kira? Ugh! Gross! Whatever this thing can do, friend, I suggest you do it as soon as... Whoa! We're pulling... Oh gosh! Over 50 Gs! And increasing! Impossible! We would be long dead, that sort of acceleration. I know a couple of gravity hacks, Patel. So, where do we go now? Infinity. Beyond. Nah, that's been done before. Somewhere quiet. You can teach me some tricks, friend. Give me something I can use to outsmart Nguyen. I mean, if you have a minute. Oh, my pleasure, Patel. All I have is time. Good then. Hey Kira, do you have something to eat in here? Water, hydrogen, oxygen composites. I can synthesize that in a second. Mm, sounds tasty. Fuck you, Patels. <laughs> 